Hi, this is Debbie. Welcome back to Cheyenne Life. And I just wanted to show you what we have been doing for the last couple of days, um, pretty much over the weekend. And that is harvesting some vegetables. And right now we have some zucchini and yellow straight neck squash. You're probably getting tired of seeing these, but the thing is, is that once you start having straight neck squash and zucchini coming in, you have more and more and more of it all the time. And these are all beautiful, pretty much uniform in size. Got a couple of short ones in there, but they're still pretty big around. And they are going to taste wonderful because what we're doing today is we're going to be making some Lebanese stuffed squash. So that should be just delicious. And let me show you what else that we have harvested from the garden that I just finished harvesting. A nice bowl of green beans. And it might be a little weird. We're going to be having some food probably pretty much all over the world. But I'm going to make a pot of green beans because I just so love to eat green beans. I'll probably put some of our, our um, potatoes, the red potatoes, in with these green beans and maybe a ham hock and boil those up and they will be absolutely delicious. Now I'm a southern cook because originally I'm from Tennessee and even though a lot of southern cooks like to cook the vegetables until, as we like to say, until they're dead, um, which means mushy, I'm not really a too big of a fan of that. So I will cook these just up until they start beginning to get um, soft. Um, in fact, they'll be cooked through and soft, but still have some firmness to them. So that way you can taste and see what you're eating instead of it being just mush. So that is what we are doing today. We're going to have some Lebanese foods, a pot of green beans, and aren't those beautiful? They are just so pretty this year. Even though it took a long time to get them, they are starting to now produce. And I even have green beans that will be producing probably in another three to four weeks, so sometime mid-September. And this is a mix of Kentucky Wonder, Pole Beans, and Lander's Stringless. So right now when you pull them before they start forming the beans very big, they will mostly be stringless, but I will check them to make sure that there are not any strings in them because Kentucky Wonder does have a tendency to have strings. It says to pick them early and they won't have strings, but in my experience, they usually do. And these are just, as you can see, way longer than what it was hoping or saying that it, they would be. They're about seven to eight inches, and typically these would get about five to six so they are just beautiful, beautiful beans, and they just all of a sudden started producing like crazy. So I'm going to enjoy some beans today, and I hope everyone out there, wherever you are, is enjoying your day today, even though we're in the middle of this pandemic, um, COVID-19, all of that situation. So stay safe, enjoy your day, have something good, and make something good. And like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell to make sure you get more notices on videos when they are available. And also check out the Instagram, Instagram link down below. Make sure you get your questions in. I'm still waiting for more questions in Instagram, and I'll be glad to answer those. You can, they can be questions on anything. It doesn't have to be just gardening. And if I have an answer, I'll, I'll give you the answer. If I don't, I'll say I don't have the answer for that. So wish everyone well. Be safe.